Van coming at you inside of my new car. Well, it's about six months old now. When I filmed this video, it was only like a month old. But I just wanted to share some quick car cleaning tips with you. And to get started, I want to know, do you keep your car clean? My husband's car is always spotless and he has a lot of rules. You'll see what mine are in a minute. But I want to just go over some of the things that help me. First is uh, make a standing appointment. So I have an appointment in my calendar every single Saturday morning at 10 a.m. I have a reminder reminder to clean my car. And at that point, I try to keep that appointment if I can. And then also I keep certain things in my car. So I always have in the side, I have a microfiber cloth. I get these from the Dollar Tree or they're not as high grade as the ones I use in my house, but I don't use them as often. Next, I have cleaner in my car. This is a glass cleaner from Armor All. I also have the all-purpose cleaner. Next, you need a vacuum cleaner because I vacuum out my car every single weekend. And last of all, you've got to train your kids to keep things clean and bring in stuff and so it doesn't pile up inside. And then the other things that I use to keep it clean, I have um, these crack fillers. They make it so that things don't fall into the crack in my car and that's where I lose cell phones and lots of things get super dirty. Okay, grab your vacuum cleaner, your microfiber cloth, and your cleaning supplies and clean your car along with me. Wet wipes. Today I have these antibacterial wipes. I want to keep things not only clean but sometimes disinfected. So I make sure to wipe down my steering wheel with those, my gear shift and any knobs that I use frequently. Eating a lot more in our car and that makes bigger messes. I usually keep some in the cup holder and that's another tip for keeping my car clean. I know some of you keep a garbage can in your car for things I don't, but I try to get things out immediately. One thing I do is I keep the plastic bags from grocery shopping. I just tuck them in the side and then I can just fill those up and then take them to the trash when they're done. But Diana, who does a channel with me too, has a whole cleaning car hack video that's really good. She uses garbage cans, so I'll put a link to that so you can check that out too. One of the most brilliant things we did when we built this house was to put in this vacuum system out in the garage so we can vacuum out our cars. So I like to use the soft brush attachment for the leather. So I'm starting at the doors. And I'm just making sure to get in any crevice or crack um, that I can see. I have more chapstick because I live in a desert. I put some chapstick in there too. And I also have some essential oil for headaches because it's peppermint it works really great for that. This one gets the dirtiest. Look at this. I haven't done this. And see, it doesn't look good because I actually need to wipe these down, wipe down the petals. I'm gonna do the vents. And up here, I hate a dusty dash. Oh, they're the worst. Do not let your dash get dusty. It's so annoying to me. I can't handle it. Okay, so now I'm gonna do some wipe downs. For this, I'm gonna use Lithium Hyper Cleanse. It's leather cleaner. This is, this is a really fun company. And it does say to spray directly on the surface. So there we go. Huh, much better. And then we got some like stuff to wipe up. For the leather, I'm using Lithium Hyper Cleanse. For every other surface, I'm going to use the Armor All General Cleaner. Now I'm going to use the General Cleaner on the mats. I don't like the grooves in these mats. They look cool, but that means more places for stuff to hide. Okay, another place you have to get is these rails. Right there. They always get stepped on with 30 feet.
And I don't think my car looked that dirty, but if you look at my cloth, it tells a different story. I'm actually reconsidering letting food in the car, any even a bite after today's donut incident. And I gotta get the pedals. Look at that, so much better. This will look better after hyper cleanse. Ooh, yes. That looks so good. Ooh, shiny, nice. You can see what I didn't get. <laughs> okay, now I'm just gonna wipe down. I mean, I vacuumed it, but I'm gonna wipe down this. And my steering wheel, including the middle, not the controls. I've gotta get glass cleaner and spray it on my microfiber cloth. The other one, this is one like blue for windows and glass. Okay, now that looks much better. <laughs> that's it guys. I think it took me about 15 minutes to do the whole thing and that's about what I wanna spend and no more every week. I gotta know you guys, I'm not, like I said, this is only my second new car I've ever had in my whole life and because I put so much into it, I wanna keep it nice and clean. It's really motivating. I used to have the dirtiest cars. In fact, when I traded this one in, I was embarrassed how much crap my other car has. Just like houses, if you have too much storage, if it's way too big, you just fill it up. You just keep filling it up until it's, you have too much clutter and too much stuff. So I'm determined to keep this one clutter free and I really like that it doesn't have as much storage because it makes me make choices. I don't really have need to have a full meal in here, salt and pepper, the whole nine yards. I have like a first aid, I have everything in here. Water, I have food storage. I'm a prepper in the car. Uh, I don't want to be stuck in the winter. I usually have warm gloves, hat, blanket. So yeah, I could pare down a little bit. At the end of this video, I'm gonna put a link to this very dirty mom mobile car. It was a van, they had just gone camping. It was a big disaster. So if you wanna see that video, I'll put a link to that at the end of this one. In that one, we use a steam cleaner. And so if your car is really bad, I highly recommend a steam cleaner if you have one. We have tons of videos about steam cleaners. They do an amazing job on cars. So look in the video description. I'll put a link to those and so you can check those out. And that looks great. Everything's looking good. Okay, that looks great. I'm done.